Hey guys, what's going on? This is OSAS from Samsung Galaxy S3 Soft Monitor. And uh, today I'm just going to be showing you how you can turn off your screen using an on screen button that you can make invisible if you so choose to. Um, the app is called Turn Off Screen Free. It's available for free in the Play Store. There is a plus version, which is 149, that I'll go over in a little bit. But um, when you open the app, it'll ask you to activate. So just click activate and you'll get these two icons right here if you can see them Let's just drag these down to where you can actually see them um, and one's called turn off and the other one's called turn off info and so you're going to want to hit turn off info to access all the settings and whatnot if you hit turn off it'll obviously turn off your screen um, so when you go to turn off info it'll take you here and here's where you kind of get the, the app um, information and what it another cool thing that it does is it actually tracks how many times you turn off your screen throughout the day so for the free version you only get the the, the daily breakdown but if you um, buy the plus version you get the week the month and even the year so that's cool and then you can also see um, how that breaks down the more you use it obviously this would be more advantageous for plus users um, <clears throat> Here, you can also turn off the notification, um, the on button, which I'll show you in a second, and then the, the widget. So if you drop this down, <clears throat> you'll see that it's right here. It'll actually display how much time is left in the premium trial. So when you download the free version, you get seven days of the plus features, or some of the plus features, not all of them. And then after those seven days, you obviously lose those features. So... If you don't like that being in your taskbar, you can just select that, and you'll see that that goes away. And that's really it, but I'll keep it there. You can also turn the button off, and that button is right here. You can probably barely see it, but if you tap that button, your screen will go off. Now, that, doesn't, that happens in any application that you're in. So if we open up Candy Crush, you see that dot's still there full screen app, I just hit this button, my screen turns off. So, it's pretty cool. Um, if you want to adjust that button, all you have to do is tap and hold, and then it'll bring up this little mini menu. You can change the color, the uh, transparency, you can drag it right here, you see it just disappeared. You can make it really bright. Um, you can also change the size, just tap that on, or drag that, sorry, to on. It gets a little bigger, that's about it. And then if you want to move it, you can simply tap these buttons to move it around and um, once you're done or you're satisfied with where it is you just hit X it'll shake and then that's where it is tap that and your screen will turn off so back in here you can also add these widget buttons so for the free version you see that these all, almost, almost all of them say plus, but for the free version there are one or two that you can use, so you just hit this and you can add the widget. So just go back here, apps, widgets, <clears throat> fly over until you find it right here, and then just simply drag it to wherever you want. And then you see, there it is, you just hit that, your screen turns off. So there's a whole bunch of ways you can access it there, you can access it through the widget, and you can access it through the, the app icon. And um, those are really the main features of the app. It's actually really cool. I love the stat thing. I think that's very useful if you actually want to know how many times you turn on and off your, your screen. Um, and also, to uninstall it, you can just tap uninstall right here. It'll say, are you sure? Or you can tap and hold this three little, this three, um, these three buttons, I don't know, to bring up the option screen. I don't know why it's not working. <clears throat> oh, there, there you go. And then it'll say, um, uninstall. You hit that, it'll uninstall. And that's also one cool feature is, I don't know, I guess the dev developer was having some fun, but you can actually swipe to move pages, which is kind of cool. Just, you can use one hand or you can use one finger. 
and it just uses the proximity sensor to change the pages. So that's the, the app in, in total. You can check out the, the free version in the Play Store for free. It's also linked in the full tutorial, and we also have the link for the Plus version in the full tutorial as well. So just make sure to check both of those out, and also make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.